evening everybody. I'm gonna try to do a um, quick video here. Um, it's a little late so I'm gonna try to condense this a little bit. Um, I hope the lighting's okay. I tried to turn the light up. I might be kinda blurry. Um, anyways, first of all I want to start out by thanking everybody that responded to my last video about um, this choice that I need to make. Um, I got some really terrific responses and um, it just floors me that there's such there's such a community of support and uh, it makes me feel really good um, that you guys answered me honestly and just poured out your thoughts and I don't know how else to say it but just thank you from the bottom of my heart it was, it was uh, very very uh, beneficial to me um, I'm still in the thinking stage, although I'm going to say 99% I'm going to go with the RNY. Um, so, but I've got some time yet and I still might change my mind, but uh, right now it's going to be, it's going to be the gastric bypass. So, um, with that said, I'm going to do five things that you guys don't really know about me. I think Bamboo, Becky started this, so um, it's kind of fun, kind of fun to uh, share with you guys. Um, I guess my first thing would be um, my children. I mean, I do have them listed on, on my channel, but um, I just want to say that I have two of the most wonderful, wonderful children. I guess you call them young men now um, than anybody could have. They're responsible, they're respectful, um, they're, I'm very proud of them. They're very nice young men. One is 21 and one is going to be 18. Um, so they are, they're wonderful kids. I'm very proud of them. Very proud of them. And they are just my existence. That's just what I exist for is my children. Okay, so number two would be that I love the beach. I don't know if anybody's picked that up by the beach picture on my channel. And the background of my channel is, uh, is uh, Beach, North Carolina, that we frequent every year. We try to go there um, at least every year. Some, some years we go there twice a year. Um, we just recently bought a piece of property about an hour and 15 minutes from the shore. And in five years, we are planning on building down there. We just love the area. So that's number two. Number three, let's see here, I have them written down so I don't get off track here. I am a huge wine and coffee, I don't know if you call me a snob because I'm not a snob, um, connoisseur, how's that? Um, I love wine, I love a good glass of wine, matter of fact my husband has just recently started making it, having a lot of fun with that, so he's been making it for probably, well it's probably been about a good year or so. Uh, he's a really good winemaker. Um, and coffee, nice strong cup of coffee, um, I love also. And that's probably the third thing that you guys don't know about me. Uh, number four is, oh, <laughs> this is kind of a funny one, but for the past five or six years, every summer, I get poison ivy, and sometimes it's to the fact where I mean, so bad that I need to take um, a medrol dose path. And right now, you can't see it um, because it's probably too dark in here, but I do have it starting on my face, I have it under my chin, I have it on my leg, it's starting on the palm of my hand, so I might be going on a dose pack here pretty soon if it, <laughs> if it gets bad enough. I don't know what it is, I just walk outside. And it's like in the air, and boom, it's on me. So, we have a lot of poison ivy around our property, obviously. Um, so that's another thing you guys probably don't know about me. Is I fight poison ivy every summer. And, um, the last one. The last one, um, I think is, is a pretty interesting one. Um, I have, my name, of course, is banded, Pam B. The B... 
The BEE in it is actually um, initial for my middle name. Um, I was named after my grandmother, and they called her B all the time. B E, Aunt B, Grandma B, everything was B. Um, and I am very much like her, very much. Um, of course, she was a small, little, petite woman. I mean, she was like a size two. Um, so I think um, body-wise and all, I'm like my grandfather's side, but um, personality-wise, um, look-wise, I am a lot like her. So um, I lost her about eight or nine years ago. Miss her. She was just a lovely, lovely little Italian woman and a lovely person, very, very giving. Um, just whenever you, someone came to her house, you ate and you ate and you ate and you ate and that's just how she was. Um, so, but that's where the B comes from. <clears throat> and then the 23 is, is um, my birth date on a certain month and uh, my lucky number. So, um, Anyways, that's my five things that you guys probably don't know about me. And my big thank you to everyone. I'm just just so so happy with what everybody has uh, responded. And I thank you all very dearly. And um, I hope everybody has a good week. And we will talk to you guys later. Thank you to my new subscribers. Bye-bye.